Les Clark was the first of the nine old men to sign on at Disney. Les was in high school and he worked in a candy store near the old Hyperion studio. He would uh, letter the menu up on the mirror so people could read it and Walt complimented him on his lettering. So when Les graduated from high school in 1928, he asked Walt if he could have a job as an artist, and Walt said, well, bring your drawings by, and Les put some drawings together and came by, and Walt said, okay, you're hired. And he graduated high school on a Thursday. He started at the Disney Studios on that following Monday, and he was still there in the 70s. Les was right there at the dawn of Mickey Mouse, and he became kind of the Mickey master. What I always admired about Les's work on Mickey and other characters is the way he would use clothing. When you look at his scenes from The Sorcerer's Apprentice in Fantasia, his Mickey animation, Mickey's wearing this big coat, big hat, you know, big coat, loose. So the way he created these folds, it's unlike any other animator would have done. He really analyzed that. And you could do it in a really simple way, but he got really involved and wanted to show that this coat is heavy, that it's sitting on this little Mickey body, but it has the right amount of weight and that the folds are creating the right type of follow through. So his analysis of clothing is just amazing. Discover even more about Walt Disney's legendary animators with the 2017 D23 Gold Member Gift. Visit d23.com slash for details.